welcome back to Stone Magpie at the end of week 12 for our Josephine Wall Libra picture. Thank you for joining me for the update today. Without further ado, I'll peel back the paper and reveal where we're up to this week. I'll just push the canvas up slightly. There we are. So this week I've spent eight hours, 38 minutes, making a total of 106 hours, 41 minutes. And I did do a whipping on a Wednesday to do part of this. And I've managed to get to here with a few placed on the start of this section here. So I'm getting on with it and I've got about two rows left after this one. So yeah, getting to the end. Um, right, a little while ago I did promise that once I'd done quite a bit of the animal scales, I would do a comparison with the picture that I bought originally. So it's a smaller picture. I bought it on Amazon and it's a 50 by 40 version. I'll just get the picture now and hold it up here. I won't try not to get any reflection in. So here we are. As I say, it's a 50 by 40 and it had 40 colours. So you can see the animals, you can make out the elephant and a little bit of a giraffe. <laughs> if you know what it is, you know, you can see it. Um, but this part is very blurry and there is a snake in the tree here which you can't really make out. Um, again on this side we've got you can see the bird's wing and a couple of polar bears which are not very detailed, a couple of penguins but again very blurry. I mean you can't even really see the icicles coming off the scales um, and here there is no feminine symbolism at all. I'll lift up the picture so you can see the original version here, the official version I mean. Very, very different, isn't it, when you compare the two? I mean, you would expect that with being half the size. This, as I say, is a 50 by 40. I will try and move the picture down so you can see more of it without getting reflection, I hope. Um, let's try hmm. moving it across and in. There we go. And down to the bottom of the valley, which, I mean, you can tell it's a valley, but when you compare with that, huge difference, isn't there? There we are. Um, when I first got this picture, I was extremely pleased. I really like the picture and I don't think it's too bad for the size at all. I mean, you get quite a bit of detail in it. Um, I can't remember off the top of my head what I paid for this, so I will flash it on the screen so that you can compare the two. So there we are. And perhaps now you can understand why I'm absolutely blown away. <laughs> with the official version. It's just amazing. I'm going to be ever so sad to finish it, I must admit, but I have got another one ready to unbox um, because I know that I will really miss doing these. Um, right, so that's it for this week, guys. So hopefully you'll enjoy your own diamond painting. Please do keep letting me know what you're working on and what, what you're up to. And I'll look forward to seeing you on Wednesday for this week's Whipping Wednesday. Thanks. Bye for now.